Hey guys, it is Margaret, Texas Gal Treasures, and welcome to another Let's Make a Shirt video. And this is a very special, special episode. I'm gonna say special again. Um, because our, the channel just hit 11,000 subs, and I know a lot of new subscribers have joined for a lot of the merch videos that I've been putting out, so I wanted to uh, make sure I did a big thank you for that, because normally I do a jewelry giveaway, which may not appeal to some of the new subscribers that are here for merch videos and shirts and things, so I thought, wouldn't it be nice if after we finished creating the shirt in this video, I gave it away to one of the live viewers. Oh, and I meant to write down the, how about this, I'm gonna text Randy in a minute, and he'll be the one, because at the end, I'll just like say something like, you know, put a number in the between such and such and such and such in the chat and we'll we'll give it to the person who hits the number first. So anyway, hello everybody that's here live. And I was honestly I was like, okay, I better get some kind of idea because I always make it I, I, this reminds me of making sausage, or rather the analogy of making sausage. I go into it um, without an idea, <laughs> just to show the process of how we come up with an idea and then we go with it, right? Um, so yeah, I was hoping to find a little bit of an idea to kind of have in the back of my head just in case, but I just didn't. <laughs> so we'll see how it goes. Yeah. <laughs> All right. If nothing else, you'll see the process. So hello everybody in the chat. So here we go. Um, I have got some tabs open already and I have to say, I've been very remiss on using my merch informer, um, I, I pulled it up. I was like, you know what? Let me go. Let me pull it up. I get so set in my ways of how I do things um, that I forget that I have a subscription to Merch Informer <laughs> and don't go. And there's like a ton of information in there. So, um, and I think I have a, a, a link for it somewhere. I have to find it and put it in the description box. But when I went to look at it to kind of try to drum up some ideas before we started, I was like, whoa, <laughs> there's a lot of information there. Okay, so I'm gonna screen share first and um, we'll just start trying to brainstorm an idea of something to go with. And what I do is I pull up Pinterest, Twitter, now I have Merch Informer up there, um, and just kind of scroll through to try to like get an idea to going. So that's how I start. Unless I have a, I have a go-to list of ideas as well, but you know, this is <laughs> more fun to show how I go about that. So I just realized I think I have a video playing in the background. Hang on, let me stop that. <laughs> Where is it? I have so many tabs and stuff open. I just, when I opened up the link, I saw it playing. I was like, that's not right, why is that playing? Oh dear, where is it? Okay, oh, it's right here, duh. <laughs> it's the ad playing on the video. Is it, sh are you guys going, okay, duh, okay, never mind. Oh, but, but that reminds me. I was gonna share something real quick before we got started. <laughs> I, I dropped this into the groups. And um, it was this that I created. Um, so I took a picture of this little octopus and dropped it into um, Adobe Captcha. Uh, let me make sure I'm saying the name of that app right. Capture, Adobe Capture app. And um, we talked about it on the Merch Talk. Uh, Chris and Joe were, were, had mentioned it. And so I went and played with it and I made this little octopus. But then I found another um, website where I could apply filters and all sorts of stuff to it. So I did that and I kind of teased out like I'm gonna do a video next week about it and it wasn't just to be like coy but I'm waiting to because I ordered the shirt and I want to make sure it comes back and looks good before I say hey everybody here's something else you can do to make a shirt and then you go do it and it's like oh Margaret told me to do something and it was it came out crappy um, so yeah I ordered the shirt so I'm waiting to hear back you know, to get it and then I'll show you if it comes out right <laughs> so I'm trying to be good Okay, okay, back to let's find an idea. Okay, here we go. Hello, everybody in the chat. Thank you for coming. So, um, first up, I pulled up Pinterest just to get some ideas. And let's just click on pin, the little pin button, and scroll. Okay, toilet problems. Uh, oh, gosh, we don't need to see that. Um, something about cycling fashion disasters. Mm. I mean, cycling stuff can sell because people are really into cycling, biking, and Cycle cross and tri bikes and blah blah blah. Um, let's see, we got some bird. We could do something with bird watchers. Less thinky, more drinky. <clears throat> and when I was looking at Merch Informer, I'll show you in a minute. A lot of the shirts that were top sellers were were text based only. Oh, look at her dress. That's cute. Okay, keep scrolling. Don't get lost. Uh, that's cute. That seems like a lot of work went into it. 
Uh, but then again, here's some more text-based shirts. And I don't know what that is. Needleworking. If you see something, holler at me in the chat. And look, again, a bunch of text-based type stuff. We don't we can't do all over yet. So, okay, more bird watching stuff. So, okay, so maybe something with biking or maybe something with bird watching. Okay, that's where I'm at right now in my brain. So then I pulled up. Okay, so here's on Merch Informer. Um, I was searching best sellers and then by the, by the top 100 and was just scrolling through. I didn't I, I, I have to say I'm a bit embarrassed by how I haven't played with this and how much information <gasps> that I've gotten just from this. So I'm like, oh, I need to come here and play with this some more, truly. And again, I think I have a link for it somewhere. I've got to go find it. So, yeah, I mean, here's a shirt about my wife. Now, some of these I saw in here were like, I think they're companies or, you know, they're trademarked ones. My favorite daughter gave me this shirt. So it gives you like their, what they put for their bullet points. It gives their price. It gives their rank. Uh, it gives estimated monthly sales. It's, I mean, it's awesome. So, hey, Zaheer, that's my bro in there. Um, so a lot of Father's Day shirts in the top 100, but notice, just look at them. I mean, that most of them are mostly text-based with a few little bitty graphics around, dad, my superhero. This one, I, I mean, the man, the myth, the legend, I think is trademarked for sure. And Let's see, that's Musical.ly, so these are apps. I'm, I know there's a lot of friends in the chat I'm missing. Hi, Henry and Tracy. I know I saw Joni in there. Sorry if I'm missing you, everybody. Um, okay, so again, it, it just graphic-based. America, there we go. Best Papa ever, so lots of Father's Day. So I'm trying to get an idea. There's Donald Trump, America. More Donald Trump, 4th of July. The Walking Dad. So yeah, I always, I, I don't know, I, I kind of hesitate on doing stuff that are, that's too close to the line. What about back to school, right? Crying children or celebrating mom or something like that. Yeah. And then there's, oh, okay, because gay pride is coming up. So there, I saw notice some gay pride ones too. Love is love with the rainbow heart. And I love this. <laughs> Mary Poppins, y'all. Um, that's from the Guardians of the Galaxy, but yeah. I've dressed up many times for Halloween as Mary Poppins, so I <laughs> unicorns. Yeah, unicorns are always popular too. Okay, Father's Day, just do it. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Okay, so we can take a vote in the in the. Let's look at Twitter too, and then we'll take a vote on what we want to make a shirt. Cactus shirts, Eliza says, or unicorns. Oh dear. Okay, let's see. I'm looking for something that might be. Let's look at trending stuff. And then we'll figure it out. Is it depressing? Oh, boys, wait, wait. Teenage boy wears skirt to school to beat the heat. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. Cat is a breakdancing ninja. Uh, and something about ticks causes rent. What? Oh, oh, dear. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Teenage boys, so you have to be right. Okay, okay. So, okay, in the in the chat, so we've got, let me stop screen sharing. We could do, we could do something about back to school. We could do unicorns, cactus. What else did we say? Oh my gosh, now I already forgot. There was something else in there too. I'm scrolling back real fast. Or something to do with gay pride. It may be too, too late for for that because I think that's going on this weekend. Um, let's see, bir or bird watching. Okay, so write in the chat what you think. Bird watching, back to school, unicorns. Oh, cycling, that was the other one, Bike, like bicycling. So put, put your boat in the chat and we'll, we'll, we'll go with it, right? All right, I'm waiting. So I'm seeing bird watching and back to school. So far are the two choices. Nobody's saying anything. All right, if you don't choose, I will. <laughs> Hi, Jennifer. <laughs> we're trying to vote. Cycling, unicorns. Oh, dear. Okay, now we're going in more directions. We're not getting a, a majority here. <laughs> Back to school. Bird watching. Ready, set. How far in advance of a holiday event do you start pumping out shirts? Um, that's a good question. I don't know. I, I, I have them up. Like, I just put some Christmas ones up. So, cycling unicorns. That might be challenging for me. <laughs> okay, let's see what we can find. Let's go in to, and there's another back to school. 
not like personally, but a good, okay. <laughs> I told you, it's like making sausage. Okay, that would be a funny shirt. <laughs> okay, let's go back over here. I'm going to keep looking in the chat while we're, uh oh, I forgot to hit screen share. There we go. Uh, there we go. Rare <laughs> breed cycling unicorns. <laughs> that would be I, that would be challenging for me to make. I think because I'm I'm not a graphic designer. So <laughs> okay, I'm seeing more cycling. I think <clears throat> so. Let's go with that. So now I go to some of the different sites to find a bike that I like. So let's put bicycle. Uh, this is Graphic Stock. Now, Graphic Stock is a paid site, but there's a free trial, free seven-day trial where you can download, um, I don't know, 100-something images, and I have the link down below. So let's do vectors for bicycles. There's all different things, and we'll, we'll look into, we'll do a little research on bike, bicycling and then um, kind of gear our way towards that. So here's a bunch of different uh, images that we can use. So let's do a Google search for cycling uh, terms. Or how about we do cycling meme or maybe a cycling joke? And then let's see, when you do your own repairs for the first time, okay, oh, his pedal came off. And they have their shoes, they're, they're clipped onto those pedals. Um, once you bought the bike, cycling is a cheat chart, huh? They see me rolling, they hating. Um, went to the bike shop for a patch kit, okay. Traffic laws, you mean traffic suggestions. <laughs> yep. Um, okay, so I'm still looking. So I look through here and I try to get an idea for maybe some wording that we could put on our shirt whenever we figure out. Headwind, tailwind. Um, <laughs> I, got a, I got an idea for a crass one, but it might be funny where it's like a bicyclist and it says tailwind, but then there's like, like little farty something happening. <laughs> I know it's crass, but it might sell. I mean, seriously, crass sells. Tell me what you think about that. So like a cycler says tailwind, you know, and then the little air bubble or poof coming out. Poof, like that. So that's an idea. <laughs> oh, look, a penny. Um, that was <laughs> the first time. I, okay. So, okay, I'm going to keep going with that. Tell me what you think about the, the tailwind. And we'll see how that goes. And nobody's saying anything in the chat, so I'm I'm gonna go. <laughs> it would probably sell you all right. Let's go with it. I know it's crass, but I'm telling you what, I've sold shirts about poop. So <laughs> he ended up in it. Oh dear. Okay, we're going with the tailwind. Now, the next thing we need to do is make sure it's not a trademark term. So let's go over to USPTO and trademark, yeah, and check that out before we go with the tailwind. Just, it sounds funny, she said, Jennifer says. Okay, um, USPTO and trademark, yeah. So we'll check both of those for the term tailwind. <laughs> oh wait, no, that's not how I do it. I always, I always get mixed up on trademark, yeah, or on USPTO, the search trademark database. I bet tons of guys would buy French. Yeah, and bicycling, come on. Um, yeah, cycling. So here we go, browse dictionary words. Now I'm like, oh, I said I was giving this one away. Darn it, okay, never mind. But I, yeah, we're still giving it away. Tail, wind, tail, wind. Let's see, uh-oh, we've got some live. We've gotta make sure it hasn't to have nothing to, oh, darn it, darn, darn. All right, let's click on it and see. Tailwind. That has to be for shirts, right? Or, but it's cycling too. Software service. No. Okay. Let's take a look at this one. This one is wheelchairs. Okay. I'm going to check trademark here real quick because that might speed up my process. Tailwind. A lot of tailwinds. You <laughs> bunch of guys. Okay. Tailwind. Registered marketing, research, knives, electronic for wheelchairs, storage rack for life vest. Uh, fungicides, abandoned, consulting, abandoned, 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 sports drinks, retail gift shop, and can you do that cheat they showed in the group? Ooh, which cheat is that? Um, you'll have to let me know what, what it is. Da, 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 registered, oops, 
business management, business management, satellite processor. I'm not saying anything about bikes. That's surprising, but good. <laughs> all right, all right. Clothing. Oh my gosh, no. Clothing, namely caps, jackets, pants, shirts. Oh. Okay. What can we do? Because I, I, now it might be, I don't think it's okay because we're doing, no, I don't think so because that one says it's registered tailwind. I wouldn't, uh. okay, back to the drawing board. This happens though, but good thing we didn't go with it. I mean, unless we find a different verbiage, but no, I wouldn't go near it if there was a uh, trademark out there, yeah. <sighs> okay, back to the drawing board. Let's look at cycling stuff. Did I close out of that thing? Well, yeah, it is, that's a bu I mean, it's true, that is a bummer. But, where's my, me oh, I cycling memes, here we go. That's fine. Um, <laughs> darn it, that was a cute idea. Um, so, continuing on, let's see. Can't find fresh air. And, well, today is legs day. That's cute. And let me go on. I don't always cycle. Oh, wait. Yes, I do. That's cute. That's a good idea. <laughs> Every day is leg day. That'd be good. Every day is leg day, something like that. So let's let's search that every day is leg day. I don't think that whole thing is going to be. Every day is leg day. So okay, let's see. If just leg day is in there. I know I'm just peeking in trademarkia here. Cosmetics. Let's do over here. Let's go back and search leg day. Trademarks. Oh gosh, this site is so hard for me to wrap my brain around. There's too many buttons everywhere. So let's do leg day and see what it comes up with over here. Uh, leg day, again, that is the beer. This one is something else. And then I am going to go just check real fast and see if there are any other shirts that say that same thing. Uh, I'm using March Research. And I'm typing in every day is leg day. Every day. That's two words. Every day is leg day. Did you ever get that way or like, hang on. Every day, is that what? I should know this. One word or two, one word. Every day, every day, each day. Yeah, okay. You know, sometimes you get in there and you're like, I can't remember if that's one word or two. All right, every day is leg day. So I see 79 shirts there. And are any of them cycling related? There's a runner one. Uh, every day is leg day, just words. And <laughs> chicken, fried chicken. That one's for you, Z-Bone. If you're still there, I know how you like your fried chicken. Um, <laughs> squats. Leg day clothing is in USPTO. Is it really? Okay. But I just, I just looked at that. Did I miss it? Hang on. Let me go back to it. Leg day, but it's one word. What do we think? Gymnastic stuff. I think I, but this is as one word, so I don't know. What do we think? Gymnast clothing for gymnastics, tight sweatpants, t shirts. How, what do y'all think? I mean, because that's one word, and what we're doing leg day is two words. That's what I said. Make sure not to one word it. Good morning. I mean, it's a, it's a close one. It's a question mark. But there's some other leg days up here. Not that that means anything. But I think as long as maybe we don't have anything to do with gymnastics, perhaps. Um, yeah. Don't, yeah. We won't make, we'll make sure we don't have gymnastics anywhere in there. Okay. So I don't see anything about cycling leg day. Okay. Now, let's close these out, and let's go find a, yeah, legs for days, leg, leg day. One word is, yeah, I mean, it's close. 
all about the legs. <laughs> there we go. Um, we can do a couple versions, Eliza. How about that? We'll do a couple versions. We'll do like it's all all about the legs or something like that. We'll get it. Well, let's find a good piece of uh, cycling clip art that we can use. Oh, you can't see what I'm doing now. I have to screen share. Okay, back to screen sharing. Let's find a bike that we like and share. Here we go. So we need to make sure that now that I guess we need to have a dude or a lady on the bike because we we're talking about leg day. So there's this one, which meh, this one's kind of cool. So I'm going to save that to the side. This one's kind of cool too. It's on a hill. Um, that might be kind of cool. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. And let's see. Here's another one. Tail. Well, it's a possibility, but it, it would. Look at this one. <laughs> um, there's that one. We'll go through and decide which one we like best. She doesn't look like she's worried about leg day, so um, we're not going to use her. We're looking for somebody who's really cranking it out. That's cool. Try for fun. My husband likes to do tries. Okay. If you see any, um, Graphic Stock is a paid site, but they have a free trial where you can download some images, um, like a hundred something. So the the uh, link is down below. I, you know, Sh uh, Shiri, I'm going to say your name wrong. Shiri, I think is that's how, that's how you say your name. Um, I've seen some, but then I know some people who have gotten shirts pulled that are parody shirts. So I mostly stay away from parody. So peeking in here, this guy might be good if we did a runner every day is leg day kind of shirt. All right, I think we're running out of cycling ones. Those are kind of cool, but. All right, so now I'm going to go over and look in open clip art for bicycle. Let's see if I can spell it correctly. There we go, bicycle. And again, looking for somebody. Got to, yes and no, got to be careful. Yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a line that Amazon draws. Okay, I'm not seeing anybody really hustling on their bikes here so far. He is, but that's not really. Okay, that one's kind of cool. That's a maybe. We'll pull him up to the side. If I'm going too fast, y'all let me know. Do, do, do. Robot riding a bike. Interesting. Okay. And, okay, so that's it for this one. And let me look on Pixabay. So, bicycle, <clears throat> and let me clip on vector graphics. That guy's a maybe, save him. And, Sheree, okay. <laughs> see, this one might be okay. I'm looking for somebody who's really working it. Not just like taking a an afternoon stroll on the bike, you know. That one's kind of cool. It's got that other dude in the background. I don't like how it's faded out right there. It might be okay on some designs, but not what I want. And do do do. These guys are kind of hustling too. That's cool. Okay, so I think we've probably got. I'm gonna look on Make Merch too. Make Merch is another paid site. Um, that you can make your shirts and my guys love playing with it and coming up with shirt ideas. I'm looking to see if I see any cyclists down in here. Got to look at all your options. Let's see. I'm not seeing any. Do, do, do. Let me look in sports and activities just in case I missed it. Football, hockey, soccer, baseball, volleyball, and dance, music. I don't see any cyclists. Or anything. Uh, 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 double checking. Nope. Okay. I like the double vision one. Okay. So here we go. So we've got this this one. This one. Okay. So let's let's pretend we're at the optometrist. One or two. <laughs> so let's make a choice. This one's one. 
This one's two. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wait for the chat, and then we'll go with it. One or two? <laughs> two. Okay. One or two? Okay, most people are saying two. Okay, so two, one, you go. So we've got two or three. <laughs> two or three. You gotta get your answers in there. Two or three. Two, one and a half. <laughs> okay, I'm seeing. I'm still seeing two. Okay, two. We're gonna make this one one again. Or one. Oh no, I already know the answer is gonna be two because it's way cooler than this one. Okay, I'll answer that for you. Uh, here we go. That's that same one we were doing from before. So I think we're we're getting closer. So here's this guy. So two or one? I think we like two a lot. We may, we may be able to just, yep, two is still cooler. This one? This one's more focused on his arms, so I'm going to click off of that one. Uh, I like being at the eye doctor. I know, yeah. <laughs> then we've got, we've got two or three again. We could always do another version with that guy later. Two or three. He's our favorite. Yes, I know. I'm at, I'm, I might as well just move on with it. See, he's cool. He looks like he's really working it too. Yeah. Okay. I think we're gonna. I think we've decided. <laughs> the chat has spoken. So we are gonna download this guy. <laughs> Here he comes. I have. I am registered. I am. All right. Whatever. And eight, four, two, eight. There we go. <laughs> Everyone loves number two. <laughs> well, it's important. You should number two every day. <laughs> Chicago Grand Wrestler. <laughs> okay, so we decided that we wanted to. I'm opening an 8x10 in Pick Monkey because that's where I design. Um, and let's just go ahead and drop our image in of. Don't look at my pickles. That's private. <laughs> I'm working on my pickles right now. I'm going to show you whenever I get that other thing. Okay, so do we like them going up the hill or do we like them straight? I think we like them kind of at a, a little bit of an angle. What do we think? Oh, no, is that too much? Do we want to take this little bit off down here? Or does that make them look like they're going fast? So, all right, tell me what you think in the chat. We've got this. Maybe you want to make it a little bit bigger? We'll see. Uphill, like they're going uphill, right? A little bit more uphill. And then we can get our, oh, what do I want to do? So let's take a, take a look. I want to go look at, like they're fast, right? I want to go look at some cycling shirts, not to get ideas for what they've done, but to see how they've placed their, their words. So merch research, and I'm going to type in cycling. So, and I just want to get an idea of how they are. I'm going to do average customer reviews because I want to see ones that are selling and maybe selling well. Is my bike okay? That's cute. Um, so, okay, waiting for these little little. Ranks to load. And this is from the, um, let's see, is it Merch Tools, I think? No. What is it called? That's a keyword one. This is Merch Tools where I can pull. It shows the, the that. Okay, so this guy, stop doing that. Uh, it's got words on top, and then it's got, you know, they're kind of staggered on the bottom. I don't like it that it automatically flips over on the sides like that. I don't like it. Uh, is my bike okay? <laughs> I love them fat. That's funny. So, okay, this one's kind of curved on top and then teeny tiny text. I don't like that on the, I mean, it may be fine when it's in person, but it's so tiny, I can't read it. And real athletes run miles, not yards, okay. Um, again, I'm looking for their placement. So this one with the retirement plan, I plan on cycling. So they, they've got, ah, stop it. So that, look at their rank. They're, they've got a really good rank on theirs. So I'm looking at just the placement of things, not the wording or anything. So they've got kind of an uphill going on, and then they have 
little t font, then they've got big, and they've got you know, a, a few colors, just like two, simple, right? Two colors going on. They don't make it too fancy, but that's a really good sales rank, you know, I think. It's it's doing okay. I mean, it's not like amazing and probably in the top 100, but it's still, you know, selling four customer reviews, so it's, it's doing all right. Okay, so, and they're just simple boxy letters. They're not anything, you know, what's the word, serif or sans serif? Uh, I always have to look because like sand means without, so there's serif. They're, no, yeah, sans serif. So there's simple sans serif. Say that three times fast. Okay, now we're saying every day is leg day. Every day is leg day down here. So let's start with our. And I don't think I don't know. I don't think we would need to do any kind of curve. I mean, I guess we could, but we want it to look like it's fast. I don't know if a curve would look fast. You know what I mean? Okay, words come in here. Every, no, we decided every day was one word, didn't we? Every day. And I'm going to go ahead and center it by putting the little dotties. This is, um, when I say dotties, I mean the little circles. I line them up here so then I can center it exactly. And here we go. Make it bigger, bigger. Every day. We're not, we may not necessarily keep this. Hey, Joe, we're making a shirt uh, every day. And then we will copy and paste for now. No, we're not copying. Here we go. Stop it. There. We'll bring this down here. And we might, you know how we saw it on this other one where they kind of staggered it? We might try that effect because it's on the slant. So we might put is kind of up a little bit, you know? And then, again, put leg day below. And we can change up the font. Leg day. We can change up the sizes and all of this good stuff and the fonts and the colors and all that. Um, so, let's see. But this center doesn't look quite right to me. So, no. And this over here, no. We just have to play with it. Maybe being centered isn't going to look exactly right for this one. I don't know. Y'all tell me. Communicate. Tell me what you think. We got 41 viewers. Hey, everybody. Okay, so every day. Now, I might want to drop it down a little bit more because when I create my shirts, I I think like this right here is just, you know, where the, the neckline is going to be. So right in this area is the drop and probably right where this line is, I imagine, is right where the the cuff of the neck of the shirt will be. Try lining the L up with the E in every day. There we go. Right, because symmetry is good. Oh, that does look good because then it kind of lines up over here a little bit better. Is can get smaller. We don't have to keep is so big, you know. And but we have problems with little words <laughs> before. Every day is a leg day. Let's see where we can. I would put is just below his front pedal. So like over here, you think? Like that? Or is that going to look weird? Hmm. Uh, oh, his, or maybe his wheel? Now it's too small, maybe. Let's see. Every day. Now that's too big. Or is it? It doesn't look right in there. See, this is when it when it comes to these little articles, these little like verbs, little words like this, like we had in the other one, the flamingo one, that little one word A was giving me such a hard time. So maybe like there. More between the G and the D. We're not talking G D here, y'all. <laughs> okay, here, let's bring it. Every day is leg day. What do we think? I think this needs to be lined up more with the E. Very technical, right? Okay, so this one, now do we want to keep, try putting is between the lines between the two bikes, like here? Hang on, I'm going to save this because if I mess it up and then I can't get it back to the way I like it, I'm going to get frustrated. But oh, I, I can do that. I can uh, just go back to every day. Slanted every day. And here's the thing too. When we made when we made the, the flamingo shirts the other day, I'll have to show you. 
I talked about it on the merch uh, talk, but when we made the flamingo shirts, uh oh, wrong way. Um, the I've had three of them sell now, and it wasn't the one that we decided was the best. So every day is, hmm, what do we say? Try putting, try putting is between the lines between the two bikes, like this, like that. Is that how you mean? I don't know about that. I'm not sure if that's what you meant. Every day is like day. I don't think that looks right. So I don't think that maybe is what you slanted, slanted over here. Let's slant it at the same angle, Margaret. That might help. Slant is and leg day. Okay, is and leg day. How do we like that? Do we need to slant every day then? But then every, what do you think? Then it would look, everything would look slanty on the design. You like that one? I'm gonna save it, because then if you win, you can have it. <laughs> like so, is that is too big? Tell me what you think. Like that? You guys, I mean, I can make leg day bigger. Do I need to make every day smaller? Okay, I'm gonna save that in case you're like, that's the one I want. That one. <laughs> Export. Okay, here. <laughs> I'm putting it back here. Okay. So, save. Move is more to the left. <laughs> I really enjoy this. I hope you guys are enjoying it too. Like completely over the G or just slightly over the G? Maybe arch every day. Okay, we can try that. Every day is make leg day bigger. Okay, that's what I was thinking, Joe. I knew you'd tell me. Leg day. Every day is leg day. Do, do, do. <laughs> Don't do that. Uh, boom. Okay. Well, let's arch every day and see how that looks. Style. Curve. Now we can curve it less, like so, and tilt it a little more one way or the other. Every day is like day. What do y'all think about that? Is under the front tire. Is. Let me tilt it a little so it's equal with the, with the that. Every day is like day. That looks kind of good. Joe, you and Pizza Hut again. <laughs> okay, I'm going to save this one too because that one looks kind of cool like that. You have curve because um, maybe, I don't know, is that only one of the features? Is that one of the features of the, oh yeah, because it's got the little crown. Yeah, yeah. Okay, it's totally worth it though. I mean, I think it's like 50 bucks for the year or something like that. Do you guys like this one? Okay, let's save that out. Every day is leg day. Oopsies, I'm not saving in the right spot. No, I'm not sharing this one. Well, I'm sharing it with one of y'all. <laughs> what does Joe say? Oh, oh, he's in Subway. Okay. Is it lunchtime already? Uh, leg day. Okay, if I can spell. Leg day. Okay, so now this is good for a light shirt, you know. But if we want to put it on a, a dark, so let's say you wanted to have it on a black shirt. Now, the only problem is when we make the image white, they're both going to be white. Is that going to bother you if whoever wins it? We can make them both like a yellow. That kind of looks cool. And then we can make all the wording match up with one of the dudes. I like this one, maybe. Or we can make it white. It's totally up to you guys. Let me grab this color exactly so I make sure I get the right match do, 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 do. And boom and is boom. uh maybe no like the yellow the lighter one or hang on go back maybe change is to the lighter yellow what do you think is that too matchy matchy Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm so picky. Oh, there is there a color that would make it almost glow at night? Yeah, I'm like, it's kind of too matchy-matchy, right? Rope and reseller, it wouldn't be considered a copycat with so many of the same image. Not if it's all yours. 
you know, if if you were, if I uploaded, like with the Flamingo one, I uploaded like seven different ones. Um, it was, it was, I mean, if I ended up uploading this after I gave it away to somebody, then yeah, then that would look like I was a copycat. I'm going to save this one, then we'll try the blue and we'll try the white. I yellow, i put yellow as the title. Save. Save. I'm copying my pickle. <laughs> Canvas color back to black. Let's see. But if it's you uploading them, then they don't see it as a. I saw that, Eliza. I couldn't look just yet. So let's try white because somebody said let's try white. So let's put this like you like it all white. Okay, I'm going to save it out because whoever wins can say, you know, I want that one. Or I just might send them all because I'm not going to upload them either. Uh, every day. I guess I could have saved it out as white, but. Uh oh, I already saved that every day too. And we said we were going to look at making blue, right? A teal, like a teal color. Let's look at teal. Say when. I just have to think it's a guy probably going to be wearing it though. Is he going to like teal? I don't know. My husband has a thing against turquoise, so. Oh yeah, it, a white would look, it would glow kind of at night when the lights would hit it, yeah. The teal looks good, you like the teal? Okay, maybe I'm just a teal. Okay, maybe not with that, let's see. Let's try is with the lighter blue and the, I'm trying to stick all within the same color scheme, you know what I mean? Every day is leg day. Maybe I need every day. <laughs> do I need every day to be that to you? What do we think? Does that one look okay? White text. Okay, I'm going to save this and then I'll come back and change it to white text. I keep hitting the wrong button. Darn it. Go back. No, I'm not saving it on here. I want to save it and export it. Leave the letters white. White text with teal. Okay. At teal. I'm saving it out a bunch of different ways because whoever whoever wins it gets to say what they want. Summer colors are nice. Okay. And let's take a peek. Let me put it back on black so we can see what it looks like. So you like that one? With it all white? All right. Let me save that to you. Export. TW for teal and white. <laughs> and save. Okay. How'd we do? I think we did okay. Woohoo! Okay, let's see. Joe, you don't have oh Joe, you're in the chat, so you can't. You're participating, darn it. Um <laughs> okay, so here's what we're gonna do. I've got all these designs now, and because I'm not gonna use any of them, what I'll do is whoever the winner is, I will uh, save these out in the correct size. And I could totally do this in Illustrator. I know, but I don't know Illustrator. Oh. <laughs> um, I will um, save these out in the correct size, and then I'll email them. You don't want to win. Okay, Joe. So, Joe, text me a number between 1 and 25. Okay? And then that way, whoever in the chat... <laughs> can say, and, that, and then if you get, you can just upload all of them, right? And then, because that's what I did with the Flamingo. If you have enough spots, shoot, why not? Because I sold different, boom, boom, boom. <laughs> yeah, it's a contest. Okay, so now Joe is going to message me a number between 1 and 25, and it's okay, Jenny, you're here. We're about to, we're about to do the drawing. So in the chat, and then I will have to, it might show up different for me than it does for you, but I'm going to say the one that, is the closest, but Joe hasn't messaged me a number yet. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Pick a good one. Don't be sassy. <laughs> yeah, Myra, I'm, I, I was gonna give away the, um, the designs that we made today as a giveaway for making 11,000 subs on my channel. Okay, I'm looking now. I'm gonna say, he sent me the number, so no Chicago Crown Hustler. 
Okay, send me a number and I'm gonna look for the one that, that matched what Joe sent. I'm waiting, we're still waiting. Okay, got it, Chicago Crown Hustler. The number that Joe sent me was number one. So Chicago Crown Hustler, congratulations, yay. Um, so I don't know who you are on, for, on Facebook. So either send me a message, you know what, email me, it'll be better, because then I can email you the files. So email me at texasgaltreasures at gmail.com, and then I will uh, save these out in the right size, and I'll uh, message them, email them to you. So yay, that was fun, huh? So hopefully they sell well, and hopefully, yeah. Cause there, and when you do your um, title keywords and all that good stuff, don't put leg day as one word because we saw that gymnastics company. How many colors? Um, how many designs did we end up with? Ooh, let's see. Because I'm just going to send them all because I'm not going to upload any of them. Uh, let's see. There's two, four, six, seven. We ended up with seven designs. So he can choose, pick and choose or, or whatever. So yay, we'll have to do it again. We have 48 viewers live. Um, go over there and hit the thumbs up, everybody. And if you are watching later and you're like, darn it, um, hit subscribe and hit that little bell. Um, fun and quick, that's my middle name, <laughs> too. Anyway, joking. <laughs> Thanks, Jennifer. Um, yeah, hit the little bell to um, <laughs> get notified when I go live so that uh, you can come too and hang out. So maybe we'll do this again. I know I got the idea because I know Mike. Peterson. I think Joe, Joe may have done a video too once where he gave one away live whenever he made one, I think. Anyway, okay. Thanks again, everybody, and I will talk to you all later. Bye.